Volkswagen T-Cross. Well, there's a bit of a facelift going on now. And also this really nice color. I don't mind this at all. It's not, um, yeah, it's not very shiny, but it's very nice looking. Anyway, the front mask is a little different. The lights are a little different. The LED strip or the lack thereof. Also, the rear lights are different as well, which I actually really, really like. Let's go check it out. Compared to the previous model, there aren't any tectonic scale changes. Although a refresh is always welcome, as it makes the updated car a bit more modern looking, while customers can get some good prices on outgoing models. Now check out these lights here. I really think these are fantastic. Probably the best thing on the car. So look, they look modern, they look sleek, nice. And actually my colleague said they remind him of something from Star Wars and I can see where he's coming from. It's like, where's Darth Vader? Let's get out of here. So what's different inside? Well, the seats are a little different. The textile is quite interesting. I like this design. And also, generally, they uh, change the dashboard a little bit. This material is quite interesting. It's not, it's not completely smooth, but it's not completely rough either. It looks a little more prestigious. Also, this part is nice and soft, which is good. They also, thankfully, stayed with physical buttons on the steering wheel. What Golf did with those uh, capacitive buttons was, it wasn't great. It was really not great for uh, use and everyday use. So um, climate controls are all capacitive, but this is the smaller system. Don't get the bigger one, which, you know, you've got all the stuff over there because it's not as nice to use as this is. At least you have your controls right there. Um, so that other one is going to be the same as something like the ID7. Engines are all gas powered and range from 70 to 110 kilowatts or 95 to 150 horsepower. There's no all-wheel drive available, but you can choose between a manual or DSG transmission. T-Cross starts at 22,000 euros. For a fully loaded R-Line model with the most powerful engine and DSG transmission, you'll be paying just over 36,000 euros.